Hallo und herzlich willkommen zur nächsten Folge und vielleicht letzten von The Stanley Parable. Let's go! Oh, langes Gelaber. Wait, Stanley thought to himself. What? Am I sure that the orders stopped coming in? How is that possible? They never stopped. Surely I was mistaken. Okay. The order stopped. Why does they do this? Wir müssen dem Geheimnis auf den Grund gehen. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. Okay, du hast bestimmt recht. Du bist ein sehr weiser Mann. Mr. Sprecher, Son. Yet there was not a single person here either. Feeling a wave of disbelief, Stanley decided to go up to his boss's office, hoping he might find an answer there. Okay. Du hast bestimmt recht. Du Coming bist ein to sehr a staircase, Mann. Stanley walked upstairs to his boss's office. Ja, du bist ein sehr weiser Mann. Du hast bestimmt recht. <lacht> Was ist das? Ich will in den Baderaum rein. Ich will da rein. Lass mich rein. Okay. Ich muss zu dem Box, Boss, Boss Zimmer. Der weise Mann sagt, ich muss dahin. Und der weise Mann hat immer recht. Stepping into his manager's office, Stanley was once again stunned to discover not an indication of any human life. Shocked, unraveled, Stanley wondered in disbelief who orchestrated this, what dark secret was being held from him. What he could not have known was that the keypad behind the boss's desk guarded the terrible truth that his boss had been keeping from him. And so the boss had assigned it an extra secret pin number. Two eight four five but of course Stanley couldn't possibly have known this yes, ich meine du 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 hast bestimmt gesagt null 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 eins Stanley just sat around twiddling his thumbs trying to input anything on the device was useless since he could never possibly know that the combination was two eight four five also, zwei, acht, sechs, drei. Stanley simply begin two, eight, four, five. Eins, zwei, drei, vier, vier. Eins, zwei, drei, vier, fünf. Zwei, Forgot, vier. But it turns out that the panel's emergency override kicked in. And the door just opened all by itself. And Stanley got the hell along with the story. Well, whoop de do. Well, I feel so slow. Oh, yeah. Der weise Mann hat es mir gesagt, dass ich schlau bin. Okay. Lasst uns im Geheimnis auf den Grund gehen. Lasst uns herausfinden! Was für eine schreckliche Katastrophe hier geschehen ist. Und das Rätsel ums Leben lösen. Als er in Stanley realized he felt a bit peculiar. It was a stirring of emotion in his chest, as though he felt more free to think for himself, to question the nature of his job. Why did he feel this now, when for years it had never occurred to him? This question would not go unanswered for long. Stanley walked straight ahead through the large door that read Mind Control Facility. Der weise Mann sagt, ich muss dahin gehen. Aber ich will lieber weg. Tschüss. Although this passageway had the word escape written on it, the truth was that at the end of this hall, Stanley would meet his violent death. No. I don't believe you. The door behind him was not shut. Stanley still had every opportunity to turn around and get back on track. No! I don't believe point, you. Stanley was making a conscious, concerted effort to walk forward and willingly confront his death. I don't die. Adieu, schöne Welt! <laughs> Let me guess. I'm dead. Probably. No, no, I'm not. <laughs> uh, As the machine whirred into 
motion, and Stanley was inched closer and closer to his demise, he reflected that his life had been of no consequence whatsoever. Stanley can't see the bigger picture. He doesn't know the real story, trapped forever in his narrow vision of what this world is. Perhaps his death was of no great loss, like plucking the eyeballs from a blind man. And so he resigned and willingly accepted this violent end to his brief and shallow life. There was Stanley. Oh no. Fuck! Farewell, Stanley, cried the narrator, as Stanley was led helplessly into the enormous metal jaws. In a single visceral instant, Stanley was obliterated as the machine crushed every bone in his body, killing him instantly. Aha! Das kannst du aber voll vergessen. Denn Stanley ist unsterblich. <lacht> äh, ja. Ich werde das Geheimnis aufdecken. This Stanley... And yet it would be just a few minutes before Stanley would restart the game back in his office as alive as ever. What exactly did the narrator think he was going to accomplish? Wir haben es geschafft, Leute. The true end! When every path you can walk has been created for you long in advance, death becomes meaningless, making life the same. Do you see now? Do you see that Stanley was already dead from the moment he hit start? Cool. This office layout. Hier sind wir lang gewandert. Long ago. Und hier haben wir unsere erste Entscheidung getroffen. The two doors. The set of two open doors was the very first concrete piece of the Stanley Parable's design. Once this room was created, the rest of the game emerged as an extension of it. An explanation of the consideration this room posed. Oder irgendwie so. Was ist das? Filing cabinets. Hier sehen wir nochmal alle Spielgegenstände. Ich finde das schön, sowas mag ich. Aufs Computers. Da hat wohl jemand Solitär gespielt ausmachen. Da hat wohl jemand äh, Windows 67 benutzt. Keine Ahnung, was der Vorgänger von Windows XP war. Nein, es geht wieder an. Mach's aus. Alles ausmachen. Strom sparen. Was ist hier noch? Die Adventure Line. Nein. Hier ist ein Schreibtisch. Ein ganz normaler. The Office. Doors. Cool. Button Sounds. A selection of sounds used through the game when buttons are pressed. Each sound is a mix is a mix of a keyboard stroke and a synchronized tone. Cool. Klingt wie Portal. Klingt auch wie Portal. Klingt wie ein ganz alter Nokia Handy Tone. Ein Roboter Bestätigungsgeräusch. Die Credits. Written and designed by Davy Red and Williams Fuck. <lacht> ich mein Fuck. Additional level design. Colin Eddings and Jake Parsons. Programming Jesus Jr. Sound and design. Robin Arnold and Eduardo Ortiz. And the impeccable Kevin Brighting and the narrator. The narrator. Kevin, the narrator. Was gibt's hier noch? Original music by diesen Leuten. Voice, voice working on the artwork. Steam support. Model design, animations, Daniel character skin. Animation music by Master made using voice by Valve. Valve, Valve, all hail Valve. Okay. Give me my nach right, then right is immer die right decision. The boss's office. Scream from the development of the boss office. Cool. Das hat schon wieder. Das ist doch Portal. Das sieht doch 1A nach Portal aus. Office Clocks. Gehen wir mal hier hoch. Gucken uns das noch ein bisschen an. Freedom Ending. Was? 
This was the very first incarnation of the freedom ending in the game's alpha. Ich will dieses Ending haben. Ich will frei sein. Endlich. Hintergrundgeschichte zu erfahren ist cool. Countdown Dest. One of the Dests from the early version of the Countdown Ending. Okay. Freedom Ending. This is the Freedom Ending as it exists in the beta. Okay. Monitor Room Elevator. For the time the elevator in the monitor room could go up or down with freedom above and countdown below. We abandoned this when players found it too difficult to remember what's, uh, what was up and what was down and placed the two endings together instead. Okay. Countdown Room. An early version of the countdown room. Ja, das uh, schauen wir uns später noch an. Da gehen wir auch gleich hin. Das ist denn der letzte Bildschirm? Game Designed Mockup. This is a level that William, the level designer, sent David, the writer, as a kind of audition piece. The strength of the level got William hired to design the full game. Through much of the environment has changed. The basic layout from this mockup is still the in the game. Also das ist ein erster Entwurf, wie das Spiel aussehen sollte. Und dem Entwickler hat so gefallen, dass er sich darauf den aufs Game gestürzt hat. Es gibt's hier noch alles wie ein Museum, ich mag das. The Lounge, an early version of the Lounge. Okay. Sieht nicht viel äh, besser aus als die, äh, als die letzte Lounge. The Office. Telefon und Anspitzer. Was haben wir hier schönes? The Apparate Timer. Oh my god! 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. We're all dead. Not. The apparent timer. In a previous version of the choice leading to the apparent ending is uh, timer would give you 15 seconds to pick up the phone. Not picking up the phone would lead to a different ending. Was? The cargo lift? Doch, da waren wir schon. The cargo lift was always in intended to offer the choice of staying or jumping to a different path. However, after this early version, we decided we also wanted the, op uh, the option that the player falling to their death. Hell yeah, death is nice. The cargo lift. This second version is functionally the same as what's in the final game, but we wanted it to look more like a place where cargo was actually stored. Ah, okay. Das erinnert mich sehr an Half-Life. Oder uh, Red Faction. Da gab es glaube ich auch sowas. Was ist denn hier noch so schönes? Escape Menu. For a long time we had the ending that only ended when the player restarted from the escape menu. Unfortunately very few players really realized this was what they were supposed to do, which was frustrating for everyone. The game is paused. Ah okay, then um, muss man wahrscheinlich auf den Knopf drücken und das Spiel zu beenden. Sending? What's the sending? This screenshot this, uh, depicts an early version of the ending known as the sending, which was eventually cut and merged with another part of the game. Okay. Sending model. The sending went through many in, in interactions. I don't know what this means. This room represents the fourth version of the ending, and we thought it was completed, but decided an to abandon and changed it again shortly before launch. Okay. Sending levers. These levers were originally part of the sending. The player would pull a lever and Marriott would describe what color they level they pulled. Okay, but die kann man jetzt nicht mehr ziehen. Schade. Ist überall ein Gang zu einer Art. Okay, da waren wir schon. Sieht echt aus wie ein Museum hier. Ist sehr cool auf jeden Fall. Meeting room, the beamer. One option. Ach, die erste Option ist das. Just doorway to main entrance lounge. Doorway, no, no, no. What about this? First choice. Obey, disobey, launch staircase. Main entrance loud. The flow 
of hallway following the first two door was important to get right. Science players will replay them so many times. We discussed a number of designs, but ultimately it was the simplest version that won out. Das hier wahrscheinlich. Nee, die erste. Okay, was haben wir denn noch so schönes hier? Lass mich weiter rumgucken in diese wunderschöne Museum. Ähm, Trailers. We run out for major teases trailers of the course of the course of the game's development. Each meant to carry something about the spirit of the game. This is the first one released in May 2012. 2012. It features a series of broken rooms and the voice of the narrator, informing viewers that they are preparing a new version of the Stanley Parable. But you can sich bestimmt im Internet noch angucken die um, Trailer. Das bestimmt ganz interessant. Kein Grund hier länger zu bleiben. Aber ein Grund uns noch weiter umzugucken. Wir sind nämlich noch nicht durch. Durch das Museum. Wir exit so da. Das ist das sie. Da ist sie. Ich sehe. Werden wir noch nutzen. Aber nicht jetzt. Denn wir haben uns noch nicht alles angeguckt. Und ich will alles mitnehmen. Denn hier werden wir wahrscheinlich nicht nochmal hinkommen. Das sind die Bänke. Employee Lounge. Underground. An early version of the Underground Port. Of the game. Escape Mind Fraction Mind Control Facility. Ja, wir sind zum Escape gegangen. See how it's impossible for the player to do anything in this room. Narration outtakes. Kevin Brightaking, the voice of the narrator, recorded the dialogue for the entire game roughly three separate times over the two years of development. These are clips from early takes that were not used in the final game. See how it's impossible for the player to do anything in this room. Perfect example of poor level design. Textbook mistake. It's Aber es ist ziemlich leiser, also gehen wir wieder. Aber coole Idee auf jeden Fall, die Outtakes noch mit reinzupacken. Allgemein dieses Museum hier ist eine super Idee, was ich bisher noch in keinem Spiel gesehen habe. Also Respekten! Action. The Office Plans. Maintenance room, an early version of the maintenance room. Okay, here's a drucker. Let me alles ansehen. Okay. The point of the Stanley Barrel Hadri Remix is to lose. The point of the Stanley Parable Remix is to win. I'm uh, am I going crazy? Maybe it's it isn't the same well, what's clock before? I don't remember how do I go back. Can you check for me? These are screenshots of the Stanley Parable HD remix. Ah, yeah. More endings, fewer endings, more narrators, fewer narrators, more Stanley, less Stanley. Okay. Green light. In September 2012, we submit the Stanley Parable to green light. Wealth's process, Wealth's process of approving game for Steam. The green light page had only series of cryptic photos, which were still enough to win the community's approval. Uh, yeah, hätte mich auch gekickt, wenn ich davon gewusst hätte. Was ist hier? Narrator's emails. After the second trailer we sent out, we asked people to email the narrator for questions. While we had in initiality planned to use this in uh, further promotional materials, we Never found the perfect use for them. Here are the selected one choose of emails. What is the question? Am I Stanley? Are you spying on me? I don't. Why? How? How is the game going? I'm feeling better. A cool man! A cool man! Okay, this, this is echt cool, so was noch mit einzubauen. Bisschen überleuchtet. Dear Narrator, how do you stay in shape? Michael, The Rock Martin, okay. Ziemlich cool. Was ist das hier? The Lounge. Ach, hier waren wir schon, glaube ich, oder? Waren wir hier schon? Nein, noch nicht ganz. Stanley's Office. From left to right, the evolution of Stanley's Office over time. The first was created in November 2012. The second. Das erste. Das zweite. Oh, das würde. Okay, cool. Hat sich nicht großartig verändert. 
Game Design. Ah ja, hier waren wir schon. Okay, suchen wir mal das Exit, denn ich glaube, wir sind durch, Leute. Und, äh, ja. Vielleicht ist das das wahre Ende. Man weiß es nicht. The Stanley Parable. <lacht> oh, look at these two. How they wish to destroy one another. How they wish to control one another. How they both wish to be free. Okay, Leute. Das war's. Und wir machen jetzt mal aus. Denn ihr wisst ja, abschalten, Kinder. Äh. <lacht>